And so folks, you welcome to KMTV Live. We are the headquarters of the the uh, press union of Liberia, so we are here for a short donation uh, from Aja, and then we listen to the, uh, the authorities here. Okay, so welcome again to the press union of Liberia headquarters, a show we are keeping social distances alive uh, during these very special times. Uh, so somewhere is saying I should wear a mask, I think it's good. Because we're wearing live already. Oh, boy, it's already. So let me do that. I might be very organized. I'm going to go back. I'm going to go You see, now, who knows? Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. Okay. The Americas. Um, the Association of Liberian Journalists in the Americas, uh, under the leadership of Joe Mason as president, yeah, has asked me to make this donation to the media community in Liberia on behalf of Alja. It's a donation of 150 bags of rice, 25 kg rice, um, 54 gallons of oil, and 1,500 marks. Uh, this is Alja's own way of identifying with the media, which finds itself in the front line in this fight against COVID-19. And uh, Alja, through his president, has asked me to convey to you, Mr. President, of the President of Liberia and the media community, that of their unwavering support in this your yeah, fight against COVID-19. Uh, this is an initial contribution from Alja, and we, they asked me to let you know that as God continue to bless them, they will always be there to identify with the media landscape in this country. So um, this, we, we formally turn over the rice, the oil, and the max, and uh, Alja has asked me uh, that the presentation we will make to the PUL, the PUL will in turn make a presentation to, or presentations to the, the various of the salaries of the press, you know, of Liberia. So, um, like we said, 150 bags, the Reporter Association will receive 40 bags of rice, with nine gallons of oil, and 300 marks. The Female Journalists Association will receive 25 bags of rice, 9 gallons of oil, and 200 marks. The Sport Writers Association will receive 20 bags of rice, 9 gallons of oil, 100 marks. Publishers Association, 15 bags of rice, 6 gallons of oil, and 100 marks. Aliko, the Association of Community Radios, will receive 20 bags of rice, 9 gallons of oil, 200 marks. The PUL leadership, staff, and veterans. As you may be aware, there are some of our colleagues who, don't, who are in no way connected with any of their salaries and are in dire need. So the PUL will directly deal with them, uh, as, long as, as well as the PUL staff. So they, that, they will receive 20 bags of rice, six gallons of oil, and uh, 100 marks. The Broadcasters Association will get 10 bags of rice six gallons of oil and 50 marks. So uh, on behalf of the Association of uh, the Association of Liberian Journalists in the Americas, Mr. President, I want to present to you a total of 150 bags of rice, uh, 54 gallons of oil and 1,500 marks from the Association of the Association of Liberian Journalists in the Americas for the the benefit of the library media landscape in this fight against COVID-19 in Liberia. Thank you. So uh, I can please extend our thanks and appreciation to Aja. Aja has been with the PUL. Whether we have some national issues, Aja will intervene and complement the efforts of the PUL. So this donation is timely. Many of our membership through the auxiliaries are in the forefront of the fight against the coronavirus. So uh, the 
uh, represented here. And we love the way it's being done. Every auxiliary of the union is here. So we praise Aya for that. The first person to identify with us as a media uh, person was Sam Howell. And then when Joe and us had a discussion, he said we'll intervene. But this one should begin with the Morovia area because we know you have a lot of people across the country. And then uh, Aliko will also cover the, the rest of the counties at their level. So we want to commend them for that. We need to do more. We call a lot of Liberian journalists. And we want many Liberians to lead the example of Aja. Uh, we want to use the public forum to also be reminded about the mass provided by the Rotary Club of Senko through Josh Morgan. And then um, the Water and Sanitation Commission gave some buckets of being donating. We're in Wyoming County to the Western region to provide some of the buckets and masks. We have the mask giving on here. And then uh, Liba also gave some masks that we're distributing. We are measuring these so as to encourage you that we need to respect the health measures. The press, the union, and all media practitioners respect the measures. So we use the mask. They are very important. Thank you. Uh, what I intend doing is to invite each of the auxiliaries and you know, to make a brief remark. Then from there we'll start the distribution. So Fija. Ladies, ladies first. Yeah, ladies first. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. These are the four. So on behalf of the Female Journalist Association of Liberia, we want to say thank you to the press senior. We want to say thank you to Aja through the press senior. We are glad that um, this has come. It has come timely for us because we are preparing to engage um, our, our members in the counties. We are carrying our activities out there so we are soon be going in the counties, we're just thinking, and we are just um, talking with the procurement officer to be able to procure masks and some sanitary, sanitation um, equipment for us to carry with us. So now that we have this mask, it has eased our burden. Even though we are still need more masks, because we're not only going to give it to members, we're going to give it to the community that will be engaging with our activities. So we are glad that they has come. Uh, it is our stress because we know the stress of getting masks from tailors and it's very very strong so now that we have masks at least the stress will go down a little but say thank you to Aja for the food we know what it takes to have something to put into your belly before you can go out there so we are glad at the level of the Finnish Association we want to say thank you to uh, Mr. Joseph I want to say thank you to the person of Liberia. And we are glad and we know in Liberia we say where, where small come from, more will come from there. So we are, we are glad to say thank you to Aja for your support and we look forward for more engagement. Thank you very much for everything. Aligo. Well, um, the presentation today here to the media community in Aja, clearly tells us that, you know, they are held microphone, they are been, uh, you know, in the field, because in town like this, uh, our reporters get into, sometimes some of them go in the field without food. And I mean, it's difficult, I mean, when you are hungry, you can't do your job the proper way. So I uh, want to say thank you to them. We applaud them loudly. And the donation here today would ensure that we get to our memo stations in the counties for this right to reach them. Even if it can get to them, but at least because we have 75 memo community radio stations, we are getting a ton of rice and nine gallon of oil. But we ensure that, you know, it get across, even if it can be a cup of rice, they will get it because it is a donation, you know, from. Aja, they have been doing, doing work for us, for the media community in Liberia. Thank you very much. We are holding like later. Thank you. Reporters Association of Liberia. Cecilia Alma Honfia. 
Alright, on behalf of my president, Madam Cecilia Clark, and all my own leadership, including all the recruiters, we say thank you. Like our president, our president, well, thank you, yeah. We appreciate the full attempt and the non full attempt. Because in time like this, politicians only direct their donations to, let's say, people that will vote for them, but not people that can get their voices on air or not to news article for them. So for Aja to sit in America and think about us, it means a lot, and we appreciate them for it. Mr. Joseph, please extend our heartfelt thanks and appreciation to our colleagues in America. We appreciate this game wholeheartedly. Oh, Thank you very much. Publisher Association to be represented by Paul Bono is on the director of the president of Talu Kamla. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to say thanks to the press union of Liberia, which is our modern body. And we also like to say thanks to Mr. Malcolm Joseph, who has always been there, and a direct representative of Ajah here at this time. And we'd like to also say thanks to the Association of Liberian Journalism America. And they have done extremely well. In times like these, this is what we need. So we are very gratified for what they have done. Hotel Gabla being the president of the Publisher Association of Liberia, a designated me to say thanks. And again, <coughs> Mr. Joseph, thank you very much for conveying our message to Aja that we appreciate it. And then, of course, Mr. President of the President of Liberia and your leadership will say thank you very much. Thank you. Sports Writer Association. You know, when they get food, the next thing I have to eat. So eating, we have to have plenty. We want to say thanks to uh, our good friends in the Americas who told us, I mean, you may think a even a cup or two of these might be small, but it will do a lot. And so we want to say thanks to them, and uh, we look forward. Uh, the school writers are very, very happy. We already started distributing rest the other time for some of our members. So this one will also add to our strength to make sure all of our guys get smart. Thank you ever so much. Broadcaster. Uh, they were on their way. Is anybody here? Yeah, they still on their way. Sit there. We have the mask. Okay. Uh, okay. Let me just. I just. I just want to provide uh, a bit of information. As the the head of the various auxiliary, as you go about distributing to your members, uh, we are quite aware that some of us are members of more than one auxiliary. For example, I'm a member of SWA. I could be a member of SWA and still be a member of the Quota Association. And if I'm a woman, I could still be a member of FIDA. A publisher or whatsoever. So to make sure that we you equitably distribute this right so that more people can get. If, for example, somebody receives rice as a female journalist, we don't expect that you will get rice you're not going to get rest as a reporter from the reporter association or from the sport writer association so that everybody at least everybody will be able to get something so we expect that coordination to go on so that we can avoid that duplication i just thought to provide a clarification so that at least more people can benefit and that's sufficient to cover the the, the membership strength of the pun they just want a 50 bags of rent for example so it, it's not sufficient we wish we had enough we had Every journalist who had a bag of rice on their shoulder to go. So with the little that we've got to make sure that we manage it well so that everybody, if not everybody, at least so most of us can be able to get something. So I just thought to provide this information to the areas that don't really need us. And we know you're going to tap in people who are in those need whatever in those yeah, what have to do. You use your discretion. So uh, you all receive, then you sign. Yeah, what is the ASG? Uh, if you have please hand over now. Uh, 
Ah, so there you have it, the food distribution. Uh, uh, it's, uh, yes. Thank you So my name is God, but it points out thanks for stealing us. Uh, thanks to Arda for this great intervention. Uh, the reporters and the journalists in and around Liberia highly appreciate your efforts. Uh, thank you, Ms. Baba, for now.